Hello, welcome to the Holy Cannoli Cooking Show. My name is Ron. Today we are gonna make sausage and peppers over pasta. It is a great, simple recipe. The flavors are out of this world. It's really simple to make, and I'm gonna show you how to put that together today. So the first thing I did is I started off with two pounds of turkey sausage. And I have that right here. What I've done, I've already browned that. It's not cooked all the way through, but I've browned both sides. So I got that sitting aside, that's two pounds of turkey sausage. Then what I've taken is one red Spanish onion. Got that sauteing, I got one red bell pepper and I got one yellow bell pepper. We got that going, I got those sauteing, getting nice and caramelized in there, bringing the flavors out, bringing the sweetness out of, the, of all those onions. Those are really nice, you can hear the sizzle. I also have one teaspoon of oregano and one teaspoon of parsley. Put that in there. I also have some fresh basil. I like fresh basil, it just brings out, I'm gonna just tear that up in here. Some fresh basil, put that in here. We're just gonna break that up in there. Make it nice, we're just gonna, we don't wanna cook it too long. I also have about four or five cloves of garlic. You gotta love that garlic, right? There we go, put the garlic in there. All right, we got that sauteed. I put some, a little bit of olive oil in there. We got all, that all coming together. Look how nice and beautiful colors. So now we got that all together. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my sausage. I got some pasta obviously going right here. We're gonna use that for later. I'm gonna take my sausage, stick it in there. This is turkey sausage. You can use, obviously, regular pork sausage. Today we're just using it with some turkey sausage. A little more health conscious. Get that in there. All right. Like I said, those were, I browned these a little while ago. So they're not cooked all the way through, but they're going to continue to cook while they're in here. All right, let me set that aside. Making a bunch of noise over here. Then what I did, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to, I have 28 ounces of crushed tomatoes. This has a little bit of garlic in it already. You can buy them already in the store with the uh, different spices in it. It's got a little bit of garlic, a little bit of oregano in there. I'm gonna dump that in. Oh yeah, babe, look at that. I'm gonna put that in there. And all come together. All right, that's gonna be nice. To this, I'm also gonna add just about a cup of water, put it in there, not too much. This is gonna simmer for a while. Let me get that all happy. Now to the, get that. I have uh, salt. We don't wanna put, to, this, the turkey sausage has a lot of salt in it already. So you wanna kinda watch your salt. I got some red wine. Don't get, if you got a screw, cap, uh, screw top on your wine, that's not the wine you want to get. You don't want to cook with the screw tap, uh, the screw top kind of wine. Okay, Just get something that you, you know, it's a nice wine. You don't have to spend a hundred dollars, but I'm gonna put about a cup of red wine in there. A little more, okay, All right? A little more. Yeah, it's not gonna hurt my feelings. The flavors are wonderful. The alcohol obviously cooks off. We're gonna bring this up to a simmer. I'm gonna let that simmer for a while. I'm gonna put a lid on it. This is gonna simmer for about. 15, 20 minutes, it's all gonna to come together. It's gonna to continually cook the turkey sausage. It's gonna cook it all the way through. We're basically making like a, a stew here and it's gonna stew. All the flavors are gonna to come together. It's gonna to be great. I'm gonna put a lid on it. When that's done, I'm gonna pour it over the linguine, over the linguine. You can use linguine, you can use thin spaghetti, angel hair pasta. You can, uh, you can even put this over rice. I've done it with rice. Um, serve it with a side of risotto if you want whatever you'd like. So I'm gonna let this keep going here. I'm gonna turn up the heat a little bit. I'm gonna drain my pasta and it is gonna be dynamite. Okay, we've had our sausage simmering on the stove top. About 20, 25 minutes. Turkey sausage is cooked all the way through. Look at the beautiful colors in here. Look at all the tomatoes. Got that wine in there. It's got the wonderful flavors. It's got the garlic, oregano, basil. We got one red onion in there, just looks great. I'm gonna plate up some pasta. 
You can serve any kind of pasta you like. I'm gonna put a little bit of regular thin spaghetti on here. Like I said, you could serve this over rice if you'd like. All right, got this on here. I'm gonna take one of these beautiful turkey sausage on there. You know what, I'm gonna take two, because I can. How do you like that? All right, I'm gonna put some of this wonderful sauce. Look at that, that's just, that's liquid love right there, folks. Liquid love, you gotta love it. This is wonderful flavors. Get that over the top, oh yeah. Turkey sausage over pasta. We got some great ingredients in there. This is pretty much a very healthy dish. You can use wheat pasta, you can use a regular, like I said, you could use pork sausage if you like. This is turkey sausage. I'm gonna cut a piece of this, take a bite. You can dice this up, look at it, it's all cooked through, nice and tender. Got that, I'm gonna get some of these tomatoes on here. A little bit of the pasta. Try not to burn my mouth. This looks dynamite. Thanks for watching the Holy Cannoli Cooking Show. I'm Ron. Glad you joined us. I'm going to take a bite of this and enjoy this. Enjoy the food you make. Have fun when you're cooking. Mmm. That's dynamite. That is delicious.